Hey guys, Matt from SoundRolling.com and welcome back to 2018, uh, first video of the year. Um, this is comparing the Rykop Baseball against the uh, W5D uh, from Sherps. And uh, the whole idea of what I'm testing here is speed, the wind has to be for it to start to seep through. A lot of people wanting to use these kind of indoor options uh, for potentially outdoor uh, in kind of light, breezy conditions. So uh, let's put them to the test. Uh, and first I'll show you my rig. Okay, so obviously I've got my microphone, and then I've mounted a kind of wind windometer. I guess what they're called. Uh, they're called an anem Um And yeah, we're going to be able to uh, kind of replace these, keep everything pretty much exactly the same once I've set it up. Um, and if it gets too dark, it even has a fancy little light as well. Um, so let's kind of put it in position, and I guess I'll just wait. And if it's uh Okay, so as Sud's Law would have predicted, uh, there is no wind, unfortunately. I tried to even heat up my house, open the door to the freezing cold wind, um, and there wasn't any, uh, which is rare. But um, here we go. So basically, I need to now uh, just blow and uh, put my breath on this. Um, we'll get a, I'll start off really slow, hopefully don't die choking, and um, yeah, we'll see this kind of count up and read. So I kind of let's zoom in and uh, see it. Okay, and it should be noted that um, high pass filter is off for this demonstration. And of course, wear headphones and you'll get the most out of it because your uh, speakers uh, in your laptop aren't built for bass, bass, bass. Okay, so let's start slow and uh, see how we get, so. <sighs> okay, 131, so we'll, uh, Try again. Okay, and that's about 150. Uh, so now let's swap it over and we'll put on the W5D. Okay, now this is the whole thing with 100 hertz. Uh, just a nice round number, which means everything below 100 hertz will be cut out. Let's see if it makes a difference. Okay, so not really. Let's uh, swap it over and uh, try with the W5. Okay, so there's the rough homemade test. Um, I did have like an oven fan that I could have used, but again, it's a bit too noisy. Uh, pretty consistent with my breathing. Very good, very zen. Um, and I will do another test once this uh, actually gets windy and do, um, yeah, just more wind comparisons in general. Uh, wind is usually an absolute pain uh, to get rid of, um, especially with lavaliers. I'll do a few of those soon as well. Um, so overall final valuation, they're pretty damn similar. Uh, basically, if you get up to about half a meter a second, um, then you're going to start in introducing uh, kind of wind noise. Um, you probably will be able to take it out in post some more. Um, and again, that 100 hertz kind of gives you about 0.25 to maybe like a, a full solid one meter uh, a second um, to kind of get away with it, um, especially with someone when someone is talking um, over this, again, then that means you may have to reduce your gain, which means you might not hear the wind as much, um, but generally wind kind of distorts pretty effectively. Um, so yes, so thank you for joining me for this first video, 2018. Get down in those comments below, let me know what you think, um, and I'll actually do a whip pan test with these in another video. So, till next time, 
see you later. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I do have more. In fact, I've done over 500 videos, so there's quite a few to choose from. Apparently this one is the best recommended for you. Um, and then this one is also another best recommended one. And you can always subscribe to my face. So till next time, see you later.